Hello everyone, welcome on my channel ASP.NET Core and today I am going to show you how to fix that type of error. Actually it's not an error and uh, it's an uh, redirect URL. When we click on the register and the login button, there is uh, your view section or your the CSHTML file of the register and the login in the identity server will not show on. Because the area identity equals to page equals to and uh, page and account is a login and the register is their register but the register and the login page will not show on url changes uh, according to the register and login so how to do this how to resolve that type of problem there is register but register page is not open so how to do this uh, open your startup.cs file and in the routing here we have a use endpoints so use that a variable and points and points dot map razor pages okay so after after add this uh, things in your startup.cs file your problem will be resolved easily so you can do the, uh, you can see your output easy uh, easily so after that you have to handle enable to find the required service please add all the required service by calling i service collection add razor pages inside the call uh, configure service okay after doing this map razor pages add razor pages is also add in your uh, this file so services dot add razor pages okay so easily you have to resolve all these problem now you can see and just click on the register where your account identity account and register is there so unable to resolve service of type microsoft asp.net core.identity.user manager and application user you can see that uh, we have a application user also is there so uh, in the user manager so how to resolve this types of problem actually i have a identity user so application user if you are using application user so you can resolve uh, after that you can uh, you can see that identity user is there there is identity user so how to resolve that type of problem by using uh, here you can use identity user okay and and application user class you can see that application db context class is i have a application user class so we just resolve this okay so there is a no need to use application user class here we go so account and register identity pages and account and the register and the login accounts Here we can, uh, here we you can see that application user is directly inherited from this, and application user is also there. But in the login page, you can see shared folder login partial page. Here you can see that identity user is there, so you can use replace with application user, and application user is not there, so just inject it, and just copy and paste application user, and in application user class is view imports not there. 
tab dot models at the red using bus ticket dot models okay so after that you can see that problems if i think will be resolved bus ticket dot web dot models bus ticket dot web dot models is also mentioned at the red inject using bus ticket dot dot models ok so just saved it because application user is like that there in bus ticket dot models ok after that you have to resolve i think easily ok 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 has been registered in a register dot CS, a startup dot cs file here you can go application user class ok just let's to run your application here we go and register pages account dot register ok there is another method through email sender thank you very much for watching this video ok how to do uh, how to resolve that type of problems also so you can notice that email sender is uh, actually exists in the models folder so here we have to use email sender new class and the name is email sender and email sender is inherited from i email sender ok so use control dot resolve the problem ui dot services and here we go for a task send email oops implement that method public class email sender so just implement it control dot and implement interface that is email sender and after that you have to use return task dot completed task okay so now save this after you you can see that your problem also resolved and click on the register oops unable to resolve service of type microsoft asp.net core dot identity dot ui dot service email center while attempting to activate uh, page model okay so uh, how to resolve that uh, email server uh, start a file add dependencies services dot add scoped I email sender comma email sender okay that's fine now to solve this and here we go there is thank you very much for watching this